This, this is still, but this is going to be. Oh, shh. I thought this was done. Hello, everyone, and welcome to this winner's bracket round two match between Duck Bob and Tilbert. Yeah, this is going to be a really good match. Both of them um, really, really good runners. Tilbert definitely on for sub 130 pace. Duck Bob already there. Yeah, I mean, he's been on it for about three months. <laughs> yeah. I believe, I believe in you, Tilbert. So, um, we're starting a little late because the last race started late. So, are both runners ready to go? Yeah, I'm ready. Yep. Oh, fan is a blessing. Ah. Okay, so. Would you like to do the countdown top hat? I would love to do the countdown. So if both runners are ready, we will go in three, two, one. Let's go. I'm looking forward to this race. I've been looking Yo, forward Gio. to this race all day. Yeah, Joe. Uh, because I was down for comms for last night, and it got moved to was it? The, yeah, I think it was last night, and it got moved to tonight, and I wasn't sure. Yeah. Wait, no, is it the night? I can't remember. It might be the night before last night. Mm. It was last night, yeah. And I wasn't sure when it got moved, but yeah, turns out I still can. So, <laughs> are your donuts on? Uh, tch, 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 well, I'll say. I mean, my money's going to be on Dark Bob in, like, in my head, but I'm looking at the odds, and I'm not putting, like, a thousand. I wouldn't put a thousand donuts on Dark Bob just to win ten. <laughs> hey, donuts are donuts, dude. No, but sometimes you just you play the off bet just because yeah, the I'm odds putting, are insane. I'm putting all my donuts on uh, Tilbert 777. Oh. Yeah, I'll see. It's, the odds have dropped up something I probably wouldn't bet on. <laughs> This is going to just be a really good race all I'm, around. Like. I'm glad to see, though, like, all the people that do the bush strat in one zero, I'm glad to see how little people don't get it. Considering it's like a no reset scenario. Yeah. People are getting it like, way more often than they don't. I'm trying. I just don't know, like, the, how it works, really. You, I, you I drive into works. the bush and then, it, then you go up. And your car reset. Like, like, is it pixel perfect? I don't think it's quite pixel perfect. I don't know, like, I don't do it. I, it's it's on my list of things I can't be bothered to learn yet. Yeah, I get that. <laughs> I don't need to learn it to save time, so... Like, yeah. It's one of those things that does save time, but it's Homer 1, dude. Do, do we really care that much about Homer 1? Mm. Well, oh, suppose in Doug Think Bob's, I suppose in Doug Bob's case, Homer One does. Um, yeah, the the faster you are, the more it matters. But yeah, it's very rarely that you have such a bad Homer One that it matters in the grand scheme of your run. Oh yeah, my one thirty two. And the 11.27 home of one, my 131 had a, like, an 11.49. Yeah, that's, <laughs> exactly. I'm pretty sure not my current PB, the one before, had like a 12.30 something. <laughs> I bet you were not happy with that. Yeah. I've had blast. <laughs> I wasn't pleased, but... Yeah. It's very, like, neck and neck here. Of course, Stuck Bob already has... Neighbors, so that's an advantage to him. Also, you can kind of see the higher FPS because they were sync talking to Barney, but well, higher FPS slash Dark Bob's probably better lines, more experience because they were sync talking to Barney, and Dark Bob's I don't know a second, maybe a little less ahead that he's gained here. I would also say though that Tilbert did also clip the wall, losing his momentum driving oh. off. That, that that does cost a second. Yeah, no. That <laughs> comes under experience, I guess. You, you do yeah. that less when you've been playing as much as Dr. Panda. Mm -hmm. 
Diploma 1 is just one of those things you just can't force skill in. It just comes with bashing it out. Say is the most skill based mission in Hollow One then? Bone Storm? Bone Storm. Definitely yeah. Bone Storm. Yeah, I have to agree with that. Hilbert definitely having a bit of driving issues in this mission. Mm. Yeah, he's struggling a little. Yeah. It, it's just one of those things, it's like those little increments are just gonna like have Doug mm. just take the lead very fast. Yeah. Well, Hilbert's always been known for a long time for his really good early games, so I don't think it will. Yeah, I'm kind of, yeah, it's not going to be a huge deal so far, I think. Well, that Ooh, wasn't no, great, good. though. Uh oh. I mean, Smoothie's all doing a bit of damage to himself there. Yeah, I think he should be fine. It'll be a little slow, but. Yeah, he's on one hit. Mm, actually, I don't mind that card, so if you can judge where he's going. Which... Uh oh. There we go. <laughs> This is why I don't do cloud it just sucks. Use all the way. Uh, minivan for me. Nah, I just prefer the Ute because it's also then good for FBI. I, I think I need the help more in 1-3 than 1-5. I'm fine with my 1-5. 1-3 is hard. 1-3 banned. Me personally, I just I can't drive the minivan too well, and I just don't seem to get wasps that consistently. So I just take the Ute. Fair. Now, it is true, Gordo. Now, it is true, but I suck. Where is the sexy footage? It's uh, and... there. It's in chat. Oh, yes. Oh, there's the sexy footage. Huh? I, I just I love this cutscene. This and Bart 2's cutscene are my favorites. Um, I, I, mean, I quite like all of them. They're pretty good. Graphics are a little odd, but. True. 2003 for you. It was a it was a weird year. <laughs> I just meant more it's old technology. King FBI faster than like you tour family sedan. Uh, I don't know the specifics. You run. I was gonna say just it just it doesn't <laughs> didn't ever seen that before. I think it's a little slower than Family Sedan, partly because with Family Sedan you have ESS. But there's the balance of better wasps. Yeah, I suppose like in the long run, like getting better wasps. Yeah. 
As, as long as you keep your momentum, the power thing is not really much slower than the other two. They really, um, the traffic cars really take the lead in acceleration. And yeah. family sedans also really slow. Parkley is very misleading. Hmm. Like, once it gets up to speed, it's fine for Homo 1, it's just getting up to speed. Yeah. It's not the easiest thing in the world. Especially maintaining it. This mission sucks lately. Oh, but, uh, I don't know the other one spawned for foot. Is this a good bone sword for Duck Ball? It's not a bad star. Oh, this is a shame. If you got that yeah. then I'd have been inclined to say yes. Yeah, it was Alas. good before the shadow drop. I wonder if the traffic car in front of him just took some of the sting out of the hit. Also getting uh, shadow drop. Oh, I think the club had the better bone storm in my opinion. Um, slightly. There wasn't really much in it. Very similar. I've just noticed um. Tilbert segment timer isn't the segment timer, it's just the main timer chunk down. Oh yeah. Yeah, fair enough. I don't know why it takes me ten minutes to realise that, but... <laughs> it's not something you expect. Uh, I'm just like, oh, I wonder what the segment time is for this, and I'm like, oh... <laughs> Really speedy Hummer one for Duck Bob. Yeah, not bad at all. 11, 13, 14. It's gross. It's gonna be tight. Yeah, it's just the 13. You've got it. I think it's gonna be like an 11:37 for Tilbert. Maybe like 11:40. Oh, sports car. <laughs> Took a while to stop that, Bob. Yeah, I did not want to stop. Thirty seconds apart. So my question is, do you think this is going to persist all the way through the the race? Like, Doug Bob just taking little time increments here and there? Mm. Yeah, I think Tilbert will generally keep... I don't think Tilbert will fall too far behind from here out. Judging just by how his runs usually go with fast earlier, fast starts and stuff. I'm kind of surprised he's so far behind, but... Yeah. We'll see, I guess. But Duck, Duck Bob's going to be a tough task. He's one of the um, seven now. You have uh, every race is a sub 130. Oh, he's had a 129.55, so he's in there kind of, kind of cut it close that time. But topped his group as of second seed, so that's impressive. I couldn't imagine getting a sub 130 every race. Every <laughs> that, that just seems. Too mm. unrealistic for me at the moment. Mm. You consider at this point you have to play within what four minutes of your PB. And I assume a lot of people can do, especially at this level. When to be this good, you have to be like pretty consistent in the game to like hold that yeah. sort of pace across an hour and a half almost. Yeah, you, yeah, you got a good point there actually. Also, anything though, lately I'm just happy that I've actually had a few runs that have had sub 130 potential because that just means I can do it. And that's really good motivation for me. Hmm. 
seeing it there. It's nice. I just realized that till the second time it isn't even a level time, it's just the actual time. Yeah, that's what I meant, yeah. Oh, <laughs> I thought you meant it was a level time. No, it's the... It's a... <laughs> Ooh, Doug Bob not doing the, um, the new sports car in there, that's interesting. Um... Oh, Doug Bob would do that, like, no I don't even know the minute to, minute, to be fair. Mainly when you complete the mission and you jump, you just keep looking at the Java Center, and it near enough always gives you a sports car. Uh, when uh, the camera flicks uh, from the mission complete. He's got his sports car anyway, he got the little strap on the tree there for manipulating the movement. Oh no, but he doesn't get in front of it to really guide it over. Just yeah, gets bullied to the side. Tilbert lost his sports car, he's just driven off. to spawn in a new one. One thing I will ask is, you, you know the um, the minette where you drive into the tree and have the black van go to the right of it? Is that like a FPS specific thing? Like, can you do that on 60? No idea. But I think the idea is to make sure he's going at a certain speed to that area. So yeah. he's a... Uh, so he takes the right path. Yeah. So I, I can answer, I don't do it. <laughs> uh, Duckbob wasn't able to get the uh, car wash rods, by the way, when he was over there, it flew away from him. Tilbert just about getting dirt jumped there, having the black man go through and nearly getting through himself. Okay. <laughs> I thought Doug Bob had black fire there, not the uh the random traffic car. <laughs> it's funny. I suppose it broke his ball. Is Duckbob like a minute ahead now or something? Um, no. Like, Tilbert's within 40 seconds of finishing the mission, so... It's kind of close, but... Not really. I'd say about 40 seconds. Yeah, I'd say, yeah, they're probably about 40 seconds. Yeah, you know enough spot on there, it's 40 seconds. Look, Bob talked to Kalidus, 1737, Tilbert at 
Silver's still doing really well to keep this lane close. Good escape on his way to Gazebo. Very nice. So, how can we route it in Gazebo again? I don't think we have. I think some people just get it still. I don't know. Yeah, because I thought fast escape was uh, the new route. I think Duck. I think I don't think it's routed back in. I think Duck Bob just likes doing it still. Oh, that makes sense. It makes skipping Krusty Lou easier. Yeah, mm. that's a fair point. Especially like on Doug Bob's level, he really just wants to skip Krusty Lou and don't mm. get slow. It's like 20 seconds slow. Bart Simpson at your I wonder if I was to start getting um his Evo. You can skip crusty on 60 but 970 coins, right? Oh, yeah, like 950, 940, even 930 you could skip it with. Yeah, and that's assuming you've already got boat jump. Yeah, but on 60 though. Yeah, okay, yeah. Uh, neither of these are on 60 though, so. Yeah. <laughs> I, was, I was talking from the 60 perspective. Yeah. For 60. I think you could still do it around the same, because those numbers are assuming you've done bow jump. Oh yeah, that's good. And you yeah, can do bow jump. Bow jump is possible in Bart 2 on 60, so... I still do bow jump. Oh. That um, nearly didn't get the monkey there. Oh, <laughs> I had to no. back up for it. He's that low to the ground. No, I think he's still on parking. I think, oh, actually, I'm not sure now. Yeah, he must be. Yeah, no, I think he is. I thought he was higher up, but no, he's not. Yeah, no, it, it, it's just, it confused me. Because if his decision not to go to the left of the yeah. side... Yeah, the, the turning to... No, I, I would agree, this is... Yeah. It, it feels faster than Mr. Power just visually. Yeah, it's there you go. <laughs> Here's your last... Fine by me. Yeah, I agree with you there, Gordo. So we duck up onto sellouts. Oh, that's not a good second hit. Oh, that's a really awkward hit and run. Because oh, if God, you're too yeah. close to your, if you're too close here, which you will be, he's gonna get butt. Oh, oh, oh no. yeah. You go. had to, you had to uh, shoot the ESS. Good. I think you had to just take the monkey and run down that side and hope yeah. you're far enough away. But going for the ESS was guaranteed bust. I don't even know if you could have avoided it. Anyway. He may have been able to avoid it, it would have been close. Yeah, so, I'm not sure he would have been able to, but he probably he might have had a chance. Koba having a much better first card than uh, Duck Bob did. Duck Bob is actually... I don't think the greatest stars, but still good. Oh, that's not good. That was nearly good, but just 
far away a bit at the end. I wonder if that got being a little angled on the grass verge. Caused them issues. Till but all the traffic are almost denying him straight on this second car. This is 622 for Doug Bob. I don't think he'd be happy with that, to be fair. Uh, no, but he was pretty. Mm, yeah. He'd want better. Yeah. I'm just saying from Doug Bob's standards, I'm just. I'm just he'd want better than that. This is looking like a really good sellout for Tilbert, though. Oh, Doug Bob got busted. What? Oh, no. I missed that. What happened? He got hit, must have had hit and run at the end of the mission. Got busted, his car's in the corner, and he's missed cutscene skip. Oh, oh he's not oh, really uh, happy. This oh, Tilbert uh, Tilbert could take the lead with cutscene skip. Yeah. This is, uh... Well, this is interesting. Hmm. What if we'll see uh, Doug Bob in chat? I don't, it doesn't look like it. Yeah. Tilbert can take the lead here pretty easily. Yeah, if he get well, pretty easily. He has to get cutting to get two, three, four, five. Gets it. Tilbert takes the lead. Not Holy a huge amount, maybe my. 20 seconds. Maybe a little more. Time is time, especially in a race like this. Mm, oh, definitely. We, we've seen it before. It only takes one cutscene to change the way the race goes. One cutscene can define a win or a loss. Four races. To, I was like, yeah, four races today, and every one of them has seen a missed part one cutscene skip. Really? Mm. It is not a day for part one. Uh, as a side note, everyone who's missed part one cutscene skip today, or the other three, have won their race. Yeah, <laughs> they miss one bar cutting skips and there he wins. <laughs> to be fair, in the in Green's race, ah, oh, they are both miss part two. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So it's it's not all over, far from it. Oh, definitely. <laughs> I just I was just looking. I thought we had a few miss cutting skips. Say that was each race. Say that was each winner. I mean, it's still Lisa. Like we we've got four lethal levels to go. So. Oh, I mean, yeah. You you cannot call a race until someone <laughs> until someone's in the beam. Which one? <laughs> Which beam? Well, is... Seven seven, of course. Uh, yeah. How many times do we go in that beam? Four. Um. Yeah. Four times. God, Homer 2 sucks at like a level standpoint. But to run without a bound blow. Wow. I need to work on my cardio. Let's just do this thing. Tilbert's coins are looking a little low. Just a little. Mm. Let's see what he's on, I didn't see. He's like on 820 and he's not going for. Yeah, he's gonna oh, just it's, go for. He's gonna go for boat jumping 3 7, I think. It's oh, yeah, high. that's the new strat in there. He might just grab the vent? No, no he's so... getting Rossi loot, okay. Well, Doug Bob's gonna. Retake his lead. Well, actually, it's gonna be very close. If Tilbert stays ahead of Duck Bob here. I mean, to be fair, Tilbert will definitely have some form of like lead just through the sheer coin lead. He's, Even though he's it's not much. He's up 55, but he has boat jump still to go. He is, really? Yeah, a little behind on time, but very, very barely. Slight. Two, three seconds. Twenty-four complete. 
Yeah, yeah two, two seconds. Yeah, two seconds in it. Two seconds for 55 coins plus boat jump. So if you can essentially it. say like, well assuming he gets it, 8 seconds for 100 and... Uh, 17, although he hasn't got bonfire here, oh, he hasn't no. push him at the right angle. He might be able to keep him into the drops, and once he's in far enough, that traffic car will be enough of a buffer to really get him into the corner. So he has he has pulled it off at least, but it's not going to be as fast as Duck Bob's. True. He's going to lose a bit more time here. Yeah, it's not that much though, it's like a few seconds. It's not the end of the world. Yeah. Rather, get it. It's very recoverable. Rather get it like that than needing to restart. True. Right, very much so. Still, he's not happy though. That's a point. Tilbert's on 120. He might just not do boat jump at all. I didn't consider that. That's, yeah. Grandpa. If he doesn't do boat jump, then I, I cross you lose fair game to him. I don't blame him for getting it at all. Which means he only has like a 55 coin lead. Yeah, it's worth it. I don't like this stress. What, the going over the stones? Yeah, I, I don't like that. In I love it, it's fun. Ah, oh, Tilbert doesn't quite make it. It's possible with the... um. Any of them, actually. I think you have to be a bit further to the left for a particular sports car in the combat. Hello, you and Fish Fan are more lenient. I just personally prefer the school bus for this strat. I, I just think it's better. I hate the doing it with the school bus. I struggle to get a good e-brake boost over the, over the rocks. I'm much happier just taking it with already gained momentum. It's also it's one of those things, though, that if you line it up, pretty well in the school bus, you can get over there even without speed. True, but still. I, I've, I've got a pretty good record in the traffic cars with it, so... Yeah, I'm, I'm very comfortable with it. Yeah. I, I, I'm, I'm not comfortable doing it in a traffic car, I will always do it in a school bus. I, I think it's just as fast. I don't think it loses that much time. I think. Oh, Tilbert not having a good second car. Hmm, got away from it. Yeah. That's not one hit. Good third car by uh, Duck Pop. Yeah. He's going for the SS. I think he was a bit too far away for that really to be worth it. <laughs> Tilbert a little low. Oh. He hops over. Tilbert, stop cutting. It's so close, dude. Oh, and doesn't get the third car strap. At least it didn't light up straight. That would have been awkward if it did. Uh, maybe he could have left it. Okay, that's fine now. This is definitely not worth going for. Yeah, no, he'll just warp. Yep, time for stinky mission. Come on. RNG mission number one. Um. Yeah, this is the first follow and collect mission, isn't it? Oh, that's not good for the pub. Yeah. Oh, no. you've got to turn around quickly. Okay. Actually, that was really good the way you turned around, kind of block snake, so you wouldn't yeah. have had any speed to just fizz off. Yeah. Especially that close to the bridge as well, you would have fallen in the hole. Hmm, yeah. Okay, it's open a little bit too far behind. Yeah, especially, especially with that, that traffic. Yeah, that's hard. I don't know where that reset's going to come. Oh, oh, we almost. He actually just wants to land in front of it. Oh, that's good... awkward. You've got to turn quickly. Is he going to make it? No! And there it is. That's unfortunate because it still was close. Yeah. And Maybe. This is why this mission up. sucks. Mm. Wow. 
It's rough, it but like wasp. this one you have to pay attention. It's pretty hard. You have to pay a lot of attention this mission because if you're not careful, he'll just drop it off to the side, and you miss like it. And you missed it again. You had to jinx it, didn't you? You had to you jinx might it. Be able to keep up. It's very tight. I get a boost off the stairs. Okay, he's in range, and you can just do this minute where you hang back and you should drop it early yeah. enough because of it. This also gives you plenty of time to. <laughs> react to whatever it is. Yeah, true. Yeah, Tilbot was going, I mean, flat out and was a bit to the side of Snake's Bandit. So it was always going to be a hard pickup. I love how you curse that, though. Good job to the side. Yeah, like that. I am, so I'm saying you got to pay attention. You can't, you got to, if you're going to be behind him, you kind of got to follow his lines pretty close to what he does. Yeah. So you're close to wherever the drop is. I don't know, I just find sleuthing a very stinky mission. I like I, I like it, I always enjoy it. Nah, it gives me paranoia. <laughs> Fair. Yeah, Doug Bob's got solid lead now, about a minute and a quarter. Plus yeah. a second for this car reset that Tilbert does. Will do. Will we see Mr. Plow? I'm pretty sure we will. No. No, school bus. He's already done boat jump, hasn't he? Oh, yeah. When sure. someone is on like one fifth and above, there's boat jump in three two. You know they're probably gonna go for school bus. The most. Yeah, I still thought Mr. Plow would be faster. It is, but not everyone's necessarily got around to learning it or whatever. Maybe they don't tried it and they struggle with it. They just don't enjoy it, whatever. It's not much faster too. I mean, time is time, especially at the top level. Hmm. But if there's other things you feel like you need to focus on more than a few seconds, doing a harder strap, objective uh, probably yeah. in a 37. Yeah, I mean, he seemed pretty comfortable with fast limo. Yeah, he got it very quickly, so. Yeah. I mean, you take this. I, I, I have no idea how people can do fast limo without the reset, it just it feels far too precise. Uh, I always saw fast limos that uh, the reset is just a way to um just skip having to run over to the the school bus because then if you don't do a pause and pause it's slow because the limo does a backup. Oh, that's not good for duck. Oh, that's good. Fail that's a fail. Yeah, it's a fail. You you can't even you know it's gonna fail, but you can't even restart the mission because you're not in the car. You're like getting into a car, and those options are blocked out for you. No, that's rough. My question there is why he went for ESS again when he already has it. Why does he, he doesn't have it? Oh, the second time, yeah. Yeah. I don't know why people still do that. I mean, it's people probably the timing that. for neighbors. It's probably the timing well, he for neighbors. Does he do neighbors? No. Yeah. He hit a tough. Ah. Hmm. I don't know. It's probably like, it's just an intricate thing that's just locked in people's heads. Yeah. That's on memory. Work. That's gonna work. Yeah, nicely done. But yeah, Tobot nice. has got up a little bit thanks to that. It's a minute 14 behind, but should have a least a little faster. But still a very good split with the mission fail. Too. Is there is there anything you don't hate, Top Hat? I don't hate Farini. <laughs> I dislike Farini and ASM for the sole reason that the only time we use it is in a mission that it's just it's so not suited for. So in the context of ASM, I don't like Farini. Yeah, no, I'm I'm talking in the context of I just yeah. I like to drive the car. Well, sure, it's, it's a nice, nice car, but. Why the hell is it used for stupid game designers making the game harder? I mean, to be fair, Curator isn't the hardest thing in the world to destroy, especially in the food. Hey, Cordo's noticed the timer. You are 38 minutes late. <laughs> oh, to be fair, I didn't notice it until it 28 minutes 10 ago. 10 minutes. It was, it was in Bonestorm when I noticed, so. 
Yeah. I mentioned again in art or something. Yeah, because I thought it was a level timer and it, oh, was, it, was, it, was, just time it time. was just the level, the level timer. Hmm. I thought that spawned in the wall for Duck Bob then. Oh, uh, I didn't. So, oh, just missed the vent. He's gonna mini grind it, I guess. Maybe it was his pan all along. Ah, uh, yes. Okay. Did he get that boss? Did he get that boss? I mean, I suppose you could compare Curator to Farini from an ASM perspective. It's amazing to drive, but it's useless in ASM. Mm -hmm. uh, if we could root in Curator to replace Malibu, I would totally fucking. I prefer get Malibu. I don't know, some about the Curator I just don't enjoy as much. Well. Like, the Malibu just... feels nice to drive, and I've never felt that with the Curator. In the I, I just, stations, I've used it. it. It's in Marge, I just feel like sometimes Malibu can have very, very weird physics going over certain things. Oh. Like the return, like the ch the escape from the chase sedan in Wolves. I've never really noticed anything. That's probably just a me thing. <laughs> Which way do you go? Uh, I don't do the safe escape. If that answers your question. Do you take the shortcut or not? No. Okay. <laughs> Shortcut's slow. I, I, it's like a second and you get some coins out of it. I don't care. Shortcut's slow. <laughs> you will not tell me otherwise. Uh, I'm, I'm, uh, I'm saying, yeah, I'm agreeing. I'm just saying it's not real. It's not that slow. Yeah, no, I know. I'm just more comfortable with taking it. <laughs> uh, I, I just, I, I'm... I'm more comfortable actually taking like the non-shortcut route. I don't know why. No, that's entirely fair. I won't really ever take the shortcut route if if I know that it will save me from hit and run. Hmm. Like, if my hit and run meter is very high, I will take the shortcut route to avoid it. I think I did that once the other way round when I was a fairly new runner. Like my hit and run was very high. I always used to hit all the bins down there, so I'd always get like boost my meter up a lot down there, so I just went around and was fine. Yeah. Uh, cause I find I hit like... Ooh, I hit... Bob Bob missed the wasp. Too Ooh, far wide. Like... Too much speed, I... I think. If he needs it, he'll get it in 4-7. It's very slow to get both of them in 4-7. I think he just takes being down a wasp. He could just get one of them. Yeah, but that's usually people's. I guess he hasn't got neighbors, so. Yeah, if he needs it, he can get one in 4 7, but. Yep, and, and most importantly, he doesn't have Flanders yet. Oh, God. <laughs> 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 no, that's the thing. It, I, I mean, assuming he hasn't got Trailer Park and or a menu walk, Yeah. it guarantees that the back of school will have collision. Oh, he doesn't so, have. Yeah, he doesn't okay. have uh, Trailer yeah. Park. Yeah, so back of school would definitely have collision. So if he gets that, then it's not really too bad. I don't think I'm ever going to rout out Flanders. I love that safety net. It saved me so many times in the case of a bad armor truck. I mean, getting Flanders saved my PB run. Yeah, fair. I, don't, I just think Flanders is like really good coins for what it is. Yeah, it's it's a very good backup. I see it as. I, 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 I've said I will always get Flanders until I'm confident I will never miss armor truck. I, I try to be at a point where like my coins don't depend too much on armor truck. Like if I miss it, that sucks, but I, I like to have other ways of getting by. Yeah. That, that, that's Flanders to me. It's fair. Like, if, if I skip Flanders and I miss Armored Truck, my coins are screwed. Mm. 
Like, I, I need a coin grind or something. Bob does get the freebie. Let's go. He'll be getting hit and run last minute for four nice. tier. Oh yeah, Doug Bob never got that box. Mm. Four one. Four two? Four one. <laughs> four two. I don't remember Marge, it's like I shot. Four one is donut. Oh yeah. <laughs> it's such a useless mission. <laughs> Detour. It's such a useless mission, but costs you so much time before you answer an awkward force drop. Duck Bob had already committed himself to grabbing the van. He's managed it fairly well, though. Still able to take a wide route to get that phone booth <laughs> for two coins. Get them back a little. Come down a bit now. Interesting, goes went around the the uh, gas pumps to get the van. He just doesn't want to hit them. But he could just go behind them, there's nothing to hit. He's hit that, yeah, he's almost certainly going to get hit and run down the line here. Oh, he's very close right now. It's a fin and it's uh, He's going to dodge it for now, but... Gotta be careful. I mean, this is going to be interesting to see how he handles the... I think he's... He should be fine. I trust him to be competent enough to not really hit anything major. Barring a pedestrian just being in the way on the path, but that nah, is good now. Never never in doubt. I like actually going over that hump midway through because it actually does give Malibu a really nice boost to speed on 60. Yeah. I don't know, it just seems to have like some mild jump zone physics to it, so it just like allows Malibu to get to max speed really fast. Back on the hit and run talk, Tilbert's very close. Yeah, that's uh, that's not good, especially this early on. Hmm. I think he's already got the vend around here though. So. Oh no, he hasn't. Uh oh. Oh, it has dropped a bit. I think he's just about gonna be able to grab both boxes. We oh, hit that car though. This is gonna be um, close. He hits one up. thing. He's in a really bad situation here. Yeah, I don't know if, you know if it'll drop enough. I think he's... It'll drop enough as long as he doesn't hit. Okay, yeah. Yeah, he should be fine from here. Good problem. Carefully around the bins. Yeah, I don't blame him at all. There we go. Yeah, he should be... <laughs> I'm saying nothing. <laughs> <laughs> I'm he saying absolutely nothing. In the bag. No hit and run. Oh, that's uh, okay. Yeah, he's busted. Yeah, yeah, I hate to see it. Forcing hit and run wouldn't have been a bad idea. True, at the same time, forcing hit and run in certain areas can be mm, more just detrimental. So, yeah, but like earlier on, maybe you can, you can take the risk in the hope that they've gone by the time you get to Grandpa. True. Or you could just do what Doc Bob did and not hit anything. Yeah. Like, even at Tilbert's level, I don't think he should be hitting anything on the return. Unless it's like a pedestrian out of nowhere. Yep, not something I would specifically like to see in a tournament situation, but it would be funny if someone bought Classy in this tournament by accident. Um, uh, yeah, hopefully not on actually does it in the tournament. Yeah. <laughs> I, it wouldn't be the... It but wouldn't be it, good, but it'd be people funny. People have done it in ASM runs before. It would be a very classy mistake. Oh, that's not even an original joke. Come on. Yeah, I know it's not an original joke, but that's it is set funny. Me game up. Set me game up, top hat. Yeah, let me join the army real quick then. Yeah, I feel that too, but it's not that bad of a run. I mean, for Tilbert, who always does like really good early games, this is like bad for him. 
Good point. It's a fan compared to his average, but it's still not terrible. I mean, to, to be fair, if I got into crop circles with 48, I wouldn't be happy either. I think I'd be fine with it. Oh, I don't know what my usual times are. If I'm honest. Well, I got a 131 with a 4620 entry to crop circles. Yeah. Um, my PB has a. Oh yeah, my PB entered cramp circles in the 50s, so I'd definitely be happy with a 48. God. <laughs> What's your PB, Lambton? 135, 48. I thought you had a. I thought you were lower than that. It wasn't faster. Yeah, I thought. I thought nah. you were. I thought you were, I thought you were like a 128. Bro. What? I don't know what gave me that impression. <laughs> Doug Bob had a good pole strat, changing subjects. <laughs> <laughs> don't <laughs> ask, do not ask, you don't want to know. I, 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 my test just gone. <laughs> Thanks, just like, I thought you had like a 128.30. What the one? I'm a fifth, I was a fifth seed. You I thought you were better I than in... me! I thought you were better than me. I thought you were higher seed than me. I thought you were like seed three or something. Did you not realize I was in the lower bracket? Like, what? <laughs> no! I didn't watch any of your races. All your races happened like midnight. What happened at midnight? One was at like 3 pm. One was around this time. <laughs> <laughs> I normally play Dead by Daylight around this time. I don't normally watch me. <laughs> I'm dead. Oh, I can't. I can't. I mean, take the compliment. I thought you were better oh, than what I'll you take are. It. No, it's just hilarious. I thought you were better than what you are. That's a good moral boost, I think. <laughs> I'm just stuck. Like, Bob being one's had a very nice toll track. It's going to be suffering. Congrats on the 128, Lampton. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Genuinely thought like you look like a 128 but... I don't even know how you'd ever come across that idea. I is it because I'm like good. a I thought you were so... No, I just thought you were really good at the game. <laughs> very knowledgeable, I'm just not very good. <laughs> That's probably even large with a 51. It's not 20 ish. I don't think it'll be super happy with it. I think it'd be better. I mean, that's that's easy. Sub 130 pace. Yeah, but it's a 125 runner. <laughs> True, but when you look at the grand scheme of things, Sub 130 I mean, is good enough the, for the race. The march itself was pretty good, but the time out of it, oh my gosh, talk about flow. And on 545 points, you really don't want to miss that box. Hmm. I'd agree with that. You may get some of the wasps here. Yeah. Wow. Okay, that was a very fast color truck. When Finn said get a 237. <laughs> yeah. I thought it was going to till, but not Duck Bob. <laughs> yeah, so Duck Bob had a very good march, to be fair. Yes. A really good march. But I, I think it was mostly the uh, miscutting to it. Will he buy army? No. No. It's been a it's funny meme. That. I don't know if you got anything in the bounces. Okay, he's going to hit the magical 650 number. It's so funny. Because, like, 650 is good coins, and I hate leaving Marge with anything less than 850. <laughs> I wouldn't say 650 is good. I'm just saying it's, like, it's Manageable. manageable. You're fine, it's not great. You're gonna, you're gonna forget like almost everything, but you can carry yourself. 8 850 is definitely. 850 is excessive, here. but also makes me feel very comfortable. So, 750 is my goal, but I'm happy with 700. 800 to 850 for me. Like, my PP had like 900 coins. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I've had like good runs recently with 900 coins out of my. Way above comfortable. 
Tilpa's still getting himself a sub league goal attack, so it's not bad. Or very close to it. That's gonna be like a 3 one I think. No, the mission complete hits fast. 258. 53, 28 Marge, I think it was. Yeah, by this about 0. 0.05 seconds. So it's a minute and six apart, which isn't a... Oh, it's two minutes and six. Okay, that is I mean, a breeze. To be fair, it's, that's it's a poo cutscene. It's a sizable looking gap, but considering how far apart their PBs are, it's actually not bad at all, but... No, if, you just, if you just look at their PBs, if you ignore that Black Bob's not on a good run for him, and that Tilbert always has good early games, usually has good early games and bad late games, then it starts to mean a bit more. As I said as well, like another thing you have to consider is Doc Bob missed part one cutscene. Yeah. A poo cutscene will just even out this playing field again. Oh, uh, that's assuming Tilbert keeps pace in a poo. Very hard level. Start curator. It would definitely close the gap. But Tilbert has to play well to make sure that that's enough. Maybe help for some luck on Baby Van on both ends. <laughs> Will either of them do the Baby Van top hat strat? That's the know. question I want to know. You know, for as consistent people say that the strat that I came up with is, I don't see many people use it. It's interesting. <laughs> I, I can't be really bothered to restart mission personally. I just get in my car and look in that direction and sometimes it works. Fair. Why sometimes? I mean, it worked like the first two times and hasn't worked since. Ooh, Tilbert went, um... Underneath the one hit Quimby truck, that's really unfortunate. We, we must kill all Quimby trucks. Well, that's the thing, he went for it and then he didn't get it because it went onto two wheels. That's unfortunate. Maybe Van, it's looking decent. Uh, oh, I don't know if I'll get it. He'll push it in there. Yeah, okay, it's gonna get in. Oh, hang on, there we go. There we go. Nice. I can get out, though. I have seen it get out before. Yeah, but it doesn't look like it's going to this time. Yeah. There we go. Very nice from Dark Bob. Clean. Tilbert missed the drop, had to back out for it. Now it's pretty far away. Which might make getting coins here awkward. Easy's not going to go for them. Yeah, not getting the Venge. Definitely grabbed this. Can I face the wrong way? He can okay. get the Venge. You can get the Vens in uh, if, five if you have a bad curator or a fast armored truck. True. If you want to be crazy, you could go for them in 5-4. I'm pretty sure I've seen that before. I've definitely seen Backside of Town Hall in 5-4. It just seems weird. Actually, no, it doesn't seem weird to do it. It's the only time you definitely go to that area again. Yeah, like you pass it here. Like, you could. It'd be slow, but you could. Yeah, I'd say about three seconds, maybe. Mm -hmm. Maybe. I don't know, you have to do a pretty awkward, like, turn onto the stadium, which I imagine almost stops you. Yeah, you got a point there. It depends on the angle you come at it. Did he grab that van? Yes, he did. Nice. And gets the freebie. I hate that wasp. I am mean, different. I'm pretty good at getting it if it's got collision. If it doesn't... I'm the only uncomfortable with getting it on foot. Tilbert desperately going for this box on the long haul, he gets it! <laughs> he really did need it, he doesn't need anything else. The wasp and box at uh, Town Hall will be enough. But yeah, he did need the uh, courthouse one. Oh, gonna have to get the wasp on foot, lost all the speed. Long horn and stairs, my favourite combination. Why they made the long one like that, I'll never know. I don't think that it was an intentional part of the long one. I think they just gave it low ground current because it's a low car. Yeah, but... <sighs> you need to think from like a physics point of view. It's like physics is 
engine and coders, like, you, you should be able to realize low car and stairs do not go well. Hmm. But I, I like that some, in a, like a just design point of view, I like that some cars kind of struggle with it. Yeah. Even if from actually playing it, it sucks. <laughs> I like the fact that there are cars that are low to the ground and so struggle with it. Yeah, it's, it's what Gordo says, they've done a good job. <laughs> It should work like that, as frustrating as it is. Okay, this isn't yeah. going badly for Tilbert, even though he hasn't got a strat, he's getting the drops pretty quickly. And he should get the last two around here, if he can get... Yeah, follow this in here. Yeah, take that. For, for missing the strat. Yeah. I just like how, like, restarting the mission makes Tilt's baby van more controllable. Mm. My cartoon video game is too realistic. Feels bad, man. Feels bad. <laughs> oh, no. I mean, it's a cartoon video game, it's not meant to be realistic. Like, low cars should go upstairs fine. If not, they should go upstairs better. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, nice car bomb for Tilbert. And he's going for these vents, let's go. Fair enough. Don't blame him, he needs the coins. Either that or he needs all the monorail, and I'm pretty sure he doesn't want that. Mm. Slowly. Those coins are looking really nice here. Oh yeah, uh, he's definitely gonna be skipping the uh, four drop boss. Yeah. Like, honestly, I would be comfortable with these coins. If I had these coins, I probably would go get that wasp before jumping off monorail, but I'd be happy with these coins. Well, I more. Mm. Oh, this wasp is pretty high. I, I remember there we go. I was not happy I skipped this wasp with my run. Don't blame him, it's a fast wasp. <laughs> See, the thing was, when I came back down, he respawned with his shield, and I was just like, I'm not bothering with it. Either way, it's one extra kick. Oh, this is awkward for Tilbert. You gotta oh, be careful. No. You, oh, no. Because if he goes down this left hand side, he can get stuck like he did for LP3 earlier. Uh oh. And yeah, well, he's coming back down, he might be able to fix himself. Let's go. I had, this against Gordo. I had that happen against Gordo. It's all fun. Hmm. Yeah, LP3 ended up um, actually in his attempts to try and push Wigan into fixing himself, got hit and run after a restart mission. Oh no. Did he get the uh, the elusive crash? Oh no, because he restarted the mission. Oh yeah. <laughs> don't, mind, don't mind me, no, I have my moments. Just. <laughs> my brain I know, you just thought I was a 128 just... runner. Oh no. Oh, top hat. Bless your soul. You see, okay, the thing is with me is my head will come up with sentences before actually processing what was said beforehand. You need to realize this about me. <laughs> and yes, I did think he wrote 128 when I, I was wrong. <laughs> I don't know, dude, I just thought you were better than what you actually were. Okay. I don't know, you, just, you just feel like a 128 runner to me. That's like, no, I'm really bad at the game. <laughs> like, you say DJ Lambton, and you don't think 135 runner. You definitely don't think 128 runner. <laughs> this is me if you're talking about the. <laughs> I'm an idiot, I'm as an idiot as they come. Mm, true. <laughs> oh wow, thank you, you were meant to agree. One twenty-eight in any percent. Is that true? Um, no. I, I, my worst run in any percent was like a one twenty-five. I haven't even done any percent. It sucks. Mm. They're get a really nice armor truck there. Okay. So we're just about to grab that last drop. Very smoky boy though. 
should be fine. Uh, grab the ramp. Yeah. Worst case scenario, blows his car up, fails the mission. Yeah, that's, that's, pretty, that's a pretty worst case scenario. <laughs> it's a worst case scenario nonetheless. Yeah, sometimes when someone says it like that, they, they're being positive, like the worst case scenario isn't that bad. But no, that's, that's pretty disastrous. That's pretty bloody bad. It's like two minutes lost. Hmm. I don't like Tilbert's coins here. Uh, if he grabs stuff, he'll be fine if he gets on the truck. If he gets on the truck. But he had, he, had low, he had low coins out of Marge, remember? Yeah, true. He has been busted too. Had to get courthouse early. Um, I thought it was just, I can't remember. Yeah, it was twice, wasn't it? Yeah, he was busted in Bart and he was busted in... Was he busted in March? I thought he was busted twice. Yeah, he was busted in 4 2. 4 3, uh, 4 5, sorry. And he was Make busted in. Up. In 2 4, 2 6. Uh, yeah. Now, I'll duck Bob coming up to Curator now. They actually still come out with a low 105 or boost, so it'd still be in like the mid to higher 120s. Depends if he gets fast Curator or not, in my opinion. Yeah. Even without fast curator, it should be more like a low to mid 104. But that looks oh, good. Oh, that's nice. That's very good. nice. Very nice. You Cut love to see it. I'm saying absolutely nothing. Tab. Two gets it. Oh, nice. So stuck nice in the up floor. Nice position, by the way. But he gets the cutscene skip. 105.09. Very high 09, but 09 nonetheless. Yeah, that that's big. Yeah, Both so he's definitely on pace for like at least probably a 126. It's a pretty good time, especially for a tournament yeah, race. Faster, we'll see. Maybe he can get a high 125. I, I think another thing is like, yeah, we say like a 126, like we know he's a 125 runner, but a 126 is still really, really strong for a top. Oh, set. yeah, one, I'm saying 126 in a good sense here. Considering how like it felt like it was pretty, like it was pretty bad time out of March. <laughs> it's not, yeah. this, is, this isn't too bad now. Box taking them over 600 coins. Very close to hit and run, though. This could be bad. Oh, there it is. Uh, that's how close he is. I believe in him. Tilbert looking Tilbert. decent. Recent. Yeah, that's a that's a good car reset. If he stayed there, he could well have pushed him like alongside the wall and uh, gotten him there. stuck. But by car resetting, it gave the truck the chance to drive in on its own. Gets two very nice freebies. A very good armor truck. His coins are. I think he mm. may need lighthouse wasp. Yeah, it's gonna be close because he does already have courthouse box. Yeah, I think he's gonna. Um, I'm trying to think. So thirty, we'll get like a few crusty passes. So he's gonna have at least like fifteen more coins by the end of this mission. There's extras as well as the gazebo box. I think he'll be fine. I think he'll get to this the five forty. Out of a poo. It'll be tight, but I think we'll get there. I'll I, wait for the armor truck. There we I go. I think we'll either need either Gazebo Wasp or Lighthouse Wasp, personally. That's, that's the thing, it's gonna be close. I don't think he'll need any more than a mini grind of the Vend. Yeah. Or maybe just grabbing the early. I don't think he'll have to go for a Wasp. That of his way. Maybe, maybe not. I if he grabs this frosty glass. Okay, he's not going for it. I probably would have gone like a little out of my way for that frosty glass. Yeah. But with um you think the box, there's a crusty glass, other four coins, he'll get to he'll get to the five forty. Or very, yeah. very close. Yeah, like with the crusty glass you only need to hit like seven objects. 
and then he oh. has like 540 coins. Oh, three. That's the thing, if you get God Curator, he's gonna be three. Oh no, he's not grabbing that tree. I, I, yeah, he's oh, doesn't get the shot, okay. Drive him yeah, through the fan then, we'll take him over the 540. He's good. Yeah, he's good here. Fast backup. Good chance for the regular strat. Oh, Ooh, that... there was a car! Ooh. Oh no! There was a car further out, we didn't see it. Oh. And because he spun out, he wasn't able to follow in on the second wall. That's, uh, that's not good. That's rough. Can you get him on the middle pillar? Yeah, okay. He's fine. If he can... Oh, he's missed it! It's a little bit. Come on, dude. Oh, that's rough. Yeah, that's cost him a fair amount that's... more time. I, yeah, I think... If, if he'd gotten a good curator, I think sub-130 was... Maybe on the cards with a very fast end game, but uh, it's out now. Yeah. It's unfortunate. Hilbert isn't known for his end games, is he? Uh, he's known for having bad ones compared to his <laughs> <laughs> everything up to them. Five forty-eight gets cutscene skip. Nice. What is it? It's PB. It's at 130. Oh, wait, yeah, okay, he's not PBing. What if he's red? Probably. Be very surprised if his 130 08 is green on this. Or is what's slower than that? You know, you got a point. I'll have a look at his. He's, not, he's comparing against his worst, I can't tell you. He is 54 and a half minutes green, so. Or yellow, in case of this. <laughs> At least he won't be red. Like, that's... That, yeah, it's on his summer <laughs> Unless he was... decides to do all of like the first oh, all levels again, I'm pretty sure he won't be red. Yeah, I don't think anyone's tried that in the tournament race yet. Yeah, I'm not sure it would be allowed in the tournament race. I mean, you might get some heat for it. It's not actually against the rules, I don't think. But people are like, yo. People taking the time out to restream this. Why are you redoing half the game? Oh yes, yeah, so let me go back and complete the, like the past four levels I've already done for the reason of I want to have fun. And Tibbet grabs the box, takes them over 600. Very nice. Yes. Yes, you um. Yeah, as long as you're not doing a route where you skip 6-2, yes. I mean, you can just do all under route. I mean, technically skipping 6-2 is also an old route. Is it really? Yeah, it used to be done. And it was before walking through walls, the route was skip 6-2. I, I, I don't before know Before that, it was 6-6 six, six going grinding. Just... I don't know, just in my head, just being able to skip missions in 100 just doesn't sound right. Why? As long as you complete them. True, but I don't know, it just doesn't sound right in my head. You can complete them in any order. That one got a good stuff cut, by the way, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> Why can't we just use then unlock all missions and just go from there? For under. Oh, you got to start from a new file. You... No, it's a mod that's not allowed. I was gonna say with unlock all missions, you could start from a new file and have all the missions unlocked. No, that's that's a, that's a mod though. No. <laughs> I, I... When it, when is UAM Hundo category, which is just get open wheel and MBL and, then... and play the game. It's like new game plus. Then that, yeah. yeah. It's essentially New Game Plus Hundo, where you have to start from a low percent file, and you have to do 7567 seven. again. What type of time that would be, though? Um, well, you'd basically do the whole game in Open Wheel and MBL. Or. Oh. oh boy, using Open Wheel for two hours. Fun. Yeah, not like I didn't do that in oh, 7 Oh! Nine. I'll tell you something that would save a lot of time in it though. You wouldn't have to coin count. <laughs> you'd, have you'd have technically <laughs> done the coin counting would have been done in the file beforehand. I mean, I mean, to be fair, Gordo, 
I used open wheel for two hours in the Frank Grimes mod, and that sucked. Exactly. And that's the point. Oh, <laughs> uh, I will never play that mod again. <laughs> yeah, have you completed it yet? No. <laughs> seven seven still gives me PTSD. <laughs> The worst part about that entire mission is beating the race while going under 110. It's the rocket car, the, the rocket powered jeep just gets there so fast. It's ridiculous. Shut up, Gordo. <laughs> oh. Frank having a bit of a bit of a moment there for Tilbert. Standard Frank. Yeah, wanting to have a bit of sexy footage with the rock. That sounded better in my head. Don't worry, Goro, I'm not bullying you, I promise. I'm still probably looking for like a mid-115 here. Um, yeah, you can, get a, you can actually get a 125 out of this. I misjudged how good his part 1 was going to be. I mean, to be fair, Homer 2 needs to be really bloody good. Yeah, but like, Dog Bob's level, you trust him to have a good Homer 2. True. It's, it's, it's Homer 2, just so many things can go wrong. Like, sub-1030 like, is going to be very doable. Yeah. Jump. Looking nice. Yeah, very nice. Coins looking really good. Just needs a Krusty Burger. What is the threshold for getting Krusty Burger and being fine? Well, I, it's Krusty Burger coins is fifty something. So as long as you're with, oh, nice two pulls. As long as you're within like sixty, you can definitely. Well, you you get the. Uh, the glass now actually, so it's probably close to 60 coins for Krusty Burger if you consider the cemetery glass. So, within if you've got like 430, you can just assume he's just decided get to extras, get extras. Okay, that's I wonder if we just slightly misjudged how many he had. I have about or he's Ooh, getting too far behind oh. and he didn't. He might oh, still watch him in. No, that's that. no, he can oh, yeah, he has. I thought he'd lost it by not like immediately stopping and backing into the dove truck to edge it, him in, it, but... It depends. If dove truck got out like faster, like its natural fastest pace, then yeah, yeah he would have lost it, but dove truck behaved really well for Yeah, him. I was very surprised he was able to get back in. If you finish part 2 with 430, you can skip neighbors. Jesus Christ, I got... He was like 440 the other day. That like immediately takes you past 500. Yeah, you need to hit like a few things. Get up close to hit and run here. Hit the zombie, he's gonna get it. I just mean neighbors is 62 coins just from the boxes. I think there's some four coins and possibility of a freebie. Ooh, nice turnaround. I've never thought of doing that actually. That's actually really fast. Well, it looked fast. <laughs> Who actually knows? Oh, Tilbert. Uh, yeah, just about. I'm in there, quick. Nice. I oh, know he's open the door, he's trying to get out, don't let him out. I'm assuming Dub Bob goes for 7 2 I would be shocked if he didn't. Uh, I don't know. I, honestly, no idea. Yeah, but it wouldn't surprise me if he just went for 7 3 either. What, 7 3 sucks? Probably oh, doesn't. It's fine. Yeah, he's, uh, he's not. He's not attempted to get ahead. He's definitely going for seven three. He hit a tree. What do you mean? Yeah, but he still could have taken the shortcut and gotten ahead with the alien car. We just had a little less setup time. Okay. Yeah, you're. 
128 run. Quotation marks 128 runner. <laughs> Knowledge of a 128 runner, but the hands don't comply. <laughs> Too far to the right, in my opinion, he'll get stuck on the cage. Um, it it might be able to get away from that. He's pointing a good angle to kind of just be nudged around the cage. Yeah, a bit of adjustment. Yeah, he's he should be able to adjust his way to the side. Oh, almost off. But now he's good, and now he's pointing in the good direction to avoid the ceiling. Yeah, but he's shadow. A little slow. No, he's good. Slow, but still fast. Did you know that the hover car has a top speed of 165 due to bad coding? Um, what? Yeah, hover car can go top speed of 165. Oh, is that the thing with it going left and right? Yeah. It, I don't think it's that high. I think it gains like one or two. No, it's 165 at its maximum speed. Yeah. Yeah. I thought it was said that was like one or two faster, maybe three. No, it's 165. Okay. I've been That's informed wrong. It's, it's, it's 160 or 165, I think. It's 160 in the code. You can go like two faster or something if you wiggle a stick. Let me go and check. One moment. The code's definitely 160. You can check the car order sheet. Let's get the tilbert. Four, five, six, seven, get there. So, perfect run on cutscenes for the tilbert. Yeah, it's 165. Really? Yeah. Huh. Oh. So the scripted speed is 150, but due to acceleration model, it can go way faster on straights. It can go about 162, but downhills the fastest is the fastest. Oh, downhills! Oh, I didn't include downhills. Okay, so yeah, like the max it can go is 162, 163. Yeah. On natural straights. And that's doing the funny thing where you wiggle the stick and it works. Which yeah. duck pops on keyboard and mouse, so I don't know how well that works with AMD. What? He does this on keyboard and mouse? Yes. Have you not noticed he's in mouse look mode when he's out of the car? That's a thing. <laughs> By the way, I'm a 131 runner. Yeah. <laughs> Have you never seen Duck Bob play before? No. I don't watch his streams, I don't even think I'm followed to him. Like in the tournament, you've just been watching for the past hour and twenty minutes. I know, but come on, it's, it's late. Shocking. You have to reset this car. Yeah, I think this is going to be a low one twenty six for Duck Bob. Only one twenty eight runners know of mass look <laughs> 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 See, all the more reason why I thought you're a 128 runner. <laughs> no, I didn't know mouse look was a thing. I actually, I only know that KSFQ runs on. Uh, KSFQ is just keyboard. He doesn't have use mouse. Yeah, uh, I, I I knew he was a keyboard runner, and that's about it. But I didn't know there was like anyone else who went on mouse keyboard. Tim's uses a uh, keyboard. 
No, Doug Pop can't PB. He's a little fast, Matt. I think there's this PB, I know it's a 125. Yeah? There's some others, I can't remember off the top of my head exactly who. I watched him. I'm way out the loop, like I, 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 oh. Oh, that looked awkward with that pod. Still fine, he's, I mean, he's got it, which is the main thing. Yeah, he hasn't spawned in the area. Yeah, this is... I think this is going to be a very low 126. It's close. Yeah. And to be fair, dispersions, like... You have Shard Runners and then you just have Liquid Wi-Fi. He's just mm. on a whole different plan. To be fair, Liquid's played this, this game almost every day for... Yeah. Four or five years. <laughs> yeah, just, Liquid's on a whole different planet. Right, Bacon's so coming cool close. Stuff. Bacon's exploring. <laughs> And uh, he's on the wall. May need a little adjustment. That's awkward, that bump from the cage gets me worried. Okay, the second one was fine, he's not gonna get pushed off by it. Yeah, it just needs to make sure. Uh, an angle that's good for dodging the cage, but should need to adjust because he's gonna struggle with the ceiling. You've gotta drop down a bit and turn. Yeah. A little I, more I think. I oh fine. no, he's gone been pushed forwards. Doug Pop on seven seven, did he just do fast? Drive? Um, I don't know. Liquid is on yeah. his own, Bacon is on his own, and then there's the rest. Yeah. Oh, that's bacon. We were just talking how uh, you and Liquid are on like two completely different levels from the rest of the runners. Okay, Topic gets that fan second try. Yeah. Uh, it's a low to mid 126 here. It's a 126 OX. And it's probably a low OX. Oh! It's going pretty slow, so it's probably going to be fine. It just looked a bit scary. Yeah, yeah this is probably an 04. Maybe an 03. And how good it goes. Yeah. I thought you were pink, though, Bacon. Don't tell me you don't get that. I get it. Don't worry. On 26. Oh, three. Nice. Little 126. Called it. Yeah. <laughs> GG. So Dark Bob will advance to the next round. To face. Well, let's find out. Your face. Uh, Kelvin. Ooh, 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 that's oh, gonna that's going to be good. Stuff. That's gonna be uh that's gonna be good. Hey, Albert, on the other hand, drops down, two face. Jones it. And loses back it. Let's see you do better. I had a dog with a <laughs> 126 with a 35 47 Lisa. Very cool. Mm, nice cutscene skip as well. Ooh! Without the cutscene skip, it's a PB, I've just realized. Oh, that's unfortunate. Yeah, you're right. So, it's a very uh, good run. Cutscene skip strikes again. Hey, you did call it though that the person who's messed bot one cutscene skip is one. Yep. Yeah, you you called that in like. Well, it's the pattern of the day: four races, four missed bot one cutscene skips, and everyone oh, almost four won their race. No. So the clearly the new meta is to miss cutscene skip. Damn, I I I should do that in my race against um Garrick. I may win. Totally. It's gonna go so well. Oh yeah, no, I, I'm not even taking that race to actually win. I'm just taking that race to try and PP again. That's fair. That's probably the right way to go about it. Just go as fast as you can, and whatever happens, happens. Maybe Derek has a really, really, really bad run and somehow gets like a 131. 
<laughs> Who are you kidding? Anything I got, I got a 131 in one of his group stages. You never yeah, know. I, I wish that could have been against me. <laughs> <laughs> you never know. Any anything can happen. That is very true. All right. This tournament's been a weird one. Oh, I forgot my mission. Look at those resets, right? Um, I don't know. I'm 120, probably. Doug Bob has actually crossed the 80% win percentage on Speed Simpsons after that race. So he's, I think he's now officially the highest of anyone in double figures number of races, which I always feel is a fair like limit on those things. Yeah. How many races have I had? Um, two, uh, four, five, six, seven, eight. I don't think I've had eight races. I'll have a look. I'll check the Speed Simpson stat sheet. You've had nine races. Five wins, four losses. Tilbert lines himself up. Yeah, because I think you were four and one coming into the tournament. So you're at eighty percent. So you lost three in your yeah you lost all four of your group stages. No. Yeah. Oh, you must have been four and zero coming in. No, you lost three. Yeah, you lose three group stage matches, go to four four, and win the knockout. Yeah. Yeah, and then I've won against cricket. Yeah. Doctor Mackie is the highest plus win percentage of anyone who has more than two races. Oh yeah, no, I just I wanted to know how many like how many races I'd actually done. I didn't know if it was eight or nine. Yeah, that Bob, twenty-one wins, five losses, eighty point seven seven percent. Yeah, ba Baker Man was the highest coming into the tournament, but playing on consoles not helped. To be I fair, mean... having, having gone one and four on the tournament, Bacon has uh, still on seventy-nine point four nine percent. You gotta admit as well, like Bacon is running on console, like, he's put yeah. a massive detriment to himself. Yeah. And he's still doing really well in a tournament setting. Hmm, yeah. You gotta admit, that that's just... That's nuts. <laughs> like, that's insane. Damn, I've peaked. Might drop out before I lose to Kelvin. Can't argue with that. Oh, God, I'm not looking forward to a race in Derek tomorrow. It'd be nice to get my sub 130 tomorrow, though. That would make my day. Do you I think I'll move last. away from the SM once done I get the 140. Uh, 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 ASM just drives me nuts. I was too busy talking about stats and I just realized Tilbert's in bounds. Whoops. Yeah, he didn't get resets. Ah, um, unfortunate. Yeah, got back in oh. bounds by accident. This is looking like probably a low 134. Yeah. Uh, there's a chance for a high 133 if he drives well, but looking unlikely. Oh. Wrong collision. FPS thing. Hmm. I've had that on a range of FPSs to be fair. I think it's I've just. Had, I have had that on 60. Yeah, I've had it on 60, I've had it on 200. World War Jeep just goes zoomy zoom. Watch it, I almost built my Sunday. Learn to drive. I love how the bar crop circle is still there in Home 2. 
Well, why would it go? Ooh, it hits a hearse, fortunately, pretty tamely. Well, has a few more collisions. Not being very clean driving in this 7-7. Seven, seven. Yeah. Answer your question on like why would it go away? It's the same reason as like the Malibu sign is oh. replaced with the tire fire. He's going for bush strat. No, that's not gonna. Oh, wait, is this working? King? Let's go. It wasn't very fast, but it worked. Is that actually faster? I think if you get it like going at speed, which I don't know if it's possible. But I think the fastest you can do it, maybe. <laughs> maybe it saves a little. Okay, final jump with hit and run. Was he? Yeah, he's in. One thirty-four. Oh, seven. Oh, I lied. You liar! I've been beamed. you have been beamed. Good game. Yeah. Good race. Yeah. If uh, both runners would like to join the host chat. Hello. 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 Congratulations, Doc Bob. Decent, I'd say. Hmm. So yeah, I can't complain with that. Yeah, just dropping through the canyon air there to unfortunately fail. It's one of those things that's just like you hate to see it. Mm -hmm. Hmm. But yeah, um, four seven was really good as well. I rainbowed it and got my first sub two four. Yeah, and that was a really. You both had pretty good four sevens actually. Both yeah. had sub three. Tilbert with a two fifty eight. Four seven, uh, seven three. It was alright. Yeah, I got uh two thirty eight, so my first sub two forty. Very, very fast. Indeed, yeah. And so, I had a sub one limo, the rest was shit. Mm. Yeah, I, yeah. You yeah. were briefly ahead. To be fair, little bit until you got like crossy way. Yeah. So, Doug Bob, Kelvin in the next round. How do you feel? Um, hopefully, I have a better early game than that. <laughs> but yeah, I'm quite happy to get a time like that against him if I can. And. Hilbert, you face Jonesy in the next round. Uh, I feel confident if I practice 7 6. Yeah, fair enough. So, next race is in mm, 15 and a quarter hours, 2 p.m. Uh, mm, BST. Tomorrow, between Ticker and Sid. That's going to be a good race. Yeah, I can't even watch it, I'm busy. <laughs> so actually... I'll watch that actually, because I actually like watching Sid's content. Fair. Yeah. That should be a good one. Yeah. So we shall see you next time.